Hi, my name is Missy Gleason. I'm the managing editor for the Ohio Health Wellness Blog and Newsroom. I started my career almost 20 years ago in television. I'm a graduate of The Ohio State University. Once I got to the end of that 13 year run, I wasn't really sure what I should do next or even could do next being in a newsroom for 13 years. And I discovered the world of media relations um, or PR. I did that for six years. And then at the end of that six years, I started transitioning into our online newsroom. And that is the space where we share all of the stories that the media relations team does with local, regional, and national media, as well as stories that we now produce ourselves because we've learned that brand journalism and content marketing is a great way to tell our story along with the local and national media as well. I think it's a great idea to get media relations experience or media newsroom experience before you move into PR. It is a completely different animal working in a newsroom than it is in a corporate environment. And when you understand the time constraints and the stresses that a journalist is under, you as a PR person are going to be able to make their job easier, which is going to make them want to work with you more. You're gonna know that they don't just want somebody talking on camera, they wanna see visuals, they want B-roll, they, they don't have a lot of time. And you're gonna get that understanding when you're in an internship or have some time inside a newsroom working with those types of people. We started dabbling in telling our own stories beyond the four walls of our hospitals. Because what I was finding was that we had these wonderful stories that were being told within Ohio Health, but they weren't making their way out because we were waiting for our journalists to do them. We have so many people here at Ohio Health that are experts in their field. A lot more people are more apt to tell our story to our people because they know they'll be able to see that final product and let you know if that's really what they meant to say, if it was factual, or if they just got flustered on camera. So when we're producing the content ourselves, we can meet them where they are, we can work around their schedules, and we make the deadline. And we still get to share the people that we have, their expertise, and provide content that is educational and informative and provides a benefit to the person reading or watching. As a team in marketing communications, we all work together to share our information and what we're finding out. Something I could be investigating that might be a story for the blog might not actually turn into a story for the blog, but it would be a wonderful media pitch or something that can be used in an internal newsletter. Nobody's hoarding information, we really do share it. Another way we find stories is just watching what's gathering attention. It's just like being a news person. You look and see what's happening in the world and then you stop and you ask, is there a local tie? So in this case, we ask, is there an Ohio health tie? Do we have an expert that can speak to this topic? What can we share as a trusted partner in our community's health that will educate them, inform them, and help them make a better decision or better explain something that's happening. Really be objective. Try and look at everything from your audience's point of view. It's really easy when you're working in PR to just kind of be a mouthpiece for the people who want their message out there. But being critical and being that person to ask the tough questions and really get in your audience's head, because that's when you're really gonna dig down and figure out the crux of a story and what your audience needs to know, as opposed to maybe what the person who wants the story out there wants them to know. So I would say my advice to current students is just dream big, figure out that your job is gonna change, things are going to evolve in your field and roll with it. I never imagined when I started in media relations that this would be a job that I could have. So really don't close your mind off to opportunities and look for ways to share stories that maybe somebody else hasn't thought of yet because it could be your job in the future.